Hello, welcome to Xavier's Kitchen. Today I'm going to be preparing what I call semi vegetable soup. So I'm going to quickly show you the ingredients I'm going to be using to prepare this soup. So here's my water leaf, my chicken. You can use goat or beef or any meat of your choice. Here's my pumpkin leaf already chopped. I chopped it since yesterday. Here's my cow skin, my palm oil. I, I like using the original Enugu palm oil. It's quite tasty for soup and oba. Here's my magino, my pepper, crayfish, smoked fish, stockfish, onion, and some blended egusi. Well, I forgot salt. <laughs> So sit back while I chop my water leaf and prepare the rest of the ingredients for the soup. I want to make a meat sauce that uh, comprises of my meat, my cow skin and my stockfish and fish. So since they have a uh, different cooking time, I will start from the ones that are hard to cook. My cow skin and my stockfish first, after which I'll add my chicken and then season it up to taste. You cook it till it's done. So my meat sauce is almost ready. It comprises of my chicken, my cow skin and my stockfish. So I only added the uh, salt to it to taste. I will add the rest of the ingredients uh, while cooking the soup. My meat sauce is ready, so I'll pour it out of a, bo uh, a boil so that I can use the pot and continue the cooking. So I will set aside uh, my meat sauce, then put back the pot on fire and add my water leaf. After adding my water leaf, uh, I will add a lot of onion into it. So at this junction, if you have ukazi leaf that you pounded, it can also give the soup uh, an exceedingly yummy taste. But for this one I'm cooking, I'm not going to be adding ukazi. I'm just going to cook it straight like that. So after that, I'm going to add my my egusi into it. This uh, about uh, it's it's slightly more than half cup of egusi, and then I'm going to add my red oil, my palm oil, Enugu palm oil and I'm going to allow it to steam up for a while I guess this is about uh, uh, one and a half cooking spoon I guess so I'm going to cover it and allow the water from the water leaf to to come out and allow it to steam for a while before I continue so after about three minutes I'm I started turning it, so this is what uh, I'm already getting. My egusi is sticking to the pot. I don't want it to stick. I want it to just cook for a while before uh, I'll proceed with adding my meat sauce into it. So uh, I just added some water from the meat sauce so that I can cover it and allow it to steam up for some time for some 5 to 7 minutes before I can proceed with my cooking so after about 3 minutes of steaming uh, I'll add my fish my smoked fish and still allow it to complete its uh, 7 minutes of steaming before I can proceed So it's uh, about six minutes of steaming now. So I've gotten the texture I'm looking for. 
so as you can see the texture this is what I want to achieve so I'll proceed to adding my meat and the uh, little sauce that's remaining in it because you don't want your soup to be watery I always want mine to be thick so I just added my meat and the leftover sauce into it so I'm going to just steam it and cover it and allow it to cook for a while say three to four minutes Wow. Wow, I like the aroma of the food. So I can now add my pepper that I blended with, uh, with my crayfish. So, I'm going to stir and then allow it for about two more minutes to cook well before I will now season it with my maggi now. Wow, look at that. Look at that. Wow. Wow. Look at that. I'm even yet to add my pumpkin leaf and it's already looking yummy. Wow. So I'm going to add my my Maggie into it. Remember I'm using only two cubes for it. So I'm going to add it and then stir wow this is yummy sorry guys you know i'm the only person videoing and cooking at the same time so if uh you don't understand any question any of the procedures so you don't understand uh, how I achieve some of the outcome you can just uh, drop some question in the comment box and I will answer you directly and I'll reply as fast as possible so I'm just I added salt after adding salt I'm my pumpkin leaf is going to be the last I'm going to add. I'm going to add it now because, uh, as you can see, the soup is already done. So I just add my pumpkin leaf and voila, I'm done cooking. Wow, look at that. Wow. <laughs> okay. So I'm going to stare, stare, and stare. In less than one minute, I'm going to bring the soup down and it's ready. Wow. My love for meat though is something else. My soup is ready. So I hope you enjoy it. You can serve it with your eba, your gari, your your semo or your fufu anyone can go with it wow wow this is you wow all right thank you guys for watching